I am Jad Jarsinski, and it is a privilege to serve as principal at Peachtree Ridge High School. Welcome to the Peachtree Ridge High School's virtual commencement for the class of 2020. This year's graduating class marks Peachtree Ridge's 17th commencement. On behalf of the faculty and staff at Peachtree Ridge, we are so honored and proud of your individual and collective accomplishments. Your journey has been filled with amazing successes, along with unexpected changes that have resulted in challenges we could have never imagined. I know you did not do this alone. Thank you to the families and friends, Peachtree Ridge faculty and staff, and our amazing community for the continuous support you have and will continue to provide to these amazing individuals. To the graduating class, a special thank you from myself. Since the first day of school, you have amazed me with your passion and dedication. In addition, as first year principal, you have made myself and my family feel like we've been part of Peachtree Ridge family for years. During our virtual commencement, we will have the honor to hear from our board member, Dr. Mary Kay Murphy, CEO and Superintendent of Gwinnett County Public Schools, Mr. J. Elvin Wilbanks, Salutatorian William Au, and Valedictorian Alice Au. During this Memorial Day week, we acknowledge our courageous veterans and active duty military who serve our nation. And we pause to remember those heroes who made the ultimate sacrifice for our country. Thank you. We also want to thank the many Americans who are currently providing assistance and support during the COVID-19 pandemic. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance to our flag and the singing of the national anthem. I pledge allegiance. I pledge allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. Of the United States of America. The United, United States, States of, of America. America. And to the republic for which it stands. One nation. One, one nation. One nation. nation. Under God. Indivisible. With liberty. With liberty and justice. With liberty and justice for all. With liberty and justice for all. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we held at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air came proof through the night that our flag was still there Virtual greetings to the class of 2020 of Gwinnett County Public Schools. As your District 3 board member, I join with your principal, your high school administrative team, your teachers, and support staff to congratulate you on your academic, athletic, and community service achievements during your career in Gwinnett County Public Schools. It is an honor to participate in this virtual graduation ceremony with you and to wish you well in your future endeavors, including college, career, and civic life. You have provided a model of resilience as the coronavirus challenged you to learn in new ways, to shelter in place, and to practice social distancing all while interrupting your 2020 academic year 
and denying you end of year events, proms, and rituals. As Superintendent J. Alvin Wilbanks noted, this is a time when we either bow to fear and uncertainty or continue to go about our lives and our work with courage, common sense, and optimism. You did not give in to fear and uncertainty caused by the pandemic. Instead, you chose to move forward and went about your coursework with courage, common sense, and optimism. Today, you achieved the distinction of becoming alumni of Gwinnett County Public Schools. To you, our class of 2020, congratulations on the course that you have completed. As you move forward from being students to alumni of Gwinnett County Public Schools, you continue to have a special place in our school system. We invite you to remember us and to return often to your alma mater. To the parents and family members of the class of 2020, you have been the first teachers of our students. To you we say, job well done. We thank you parents for partnering with our principals and teachers to help our students get through this challenging period. Even as you are working outside the home or sheltering in place. To the remarkable faculty and staff of the class of 2020, thank you for your tireless commitment to our students. You have inspired them to achieve excellence, demonstrate leadership, and become exemplary citizens. Class of 2020, Congratulations to each of you and Godspeed as you move forward. Seniors, I want to join the chorus of people congratulating you on your achievement. Shortly, you will be a high school graduate. You have earned this milestone that indicates you are ready for the next phase of your life. There are several reasons why the senior year is so important for high school seniors. It is a culminating experience for the previous 12 years of school most of you spent preparing for this moment. It is the time when your learning experiences are preparing you for the college or university you plan to attend. Perhaps it is the preparation for your choice of a job or additional preparation for a technical career you have selected. Or your choice may be service in the military after graduation. Whatever your choice after high school, your hard work over the past 13 years should have prepared you to be successful in the next phase of your life. Many things can be said about your senior year of high school. Perhaps the most memorable happening, yet the least desirable one, has been the COVID-19 pandemic that has impacted all of our lives and, yes, our world. This virus changed where and how you completed your senior year. Rather than at school, you experienced teaching and learning at home. I have yet to talk with anyone, a senior student, parent, or teacher, who preferred that situation rather than students being able to finish their senior year at school. The COVID-19 pandemic also caused several other changes that normally are occurring the latter part of your senior year. I asked a senior from another school of course, to give me an indication of what he had missed 
due to the virus. His response included the following, our senior prom, the extracurricular activities that many of us would have participated in and enjoyed, the award banquets and the awards night where we would have received our academic and or athletic awards, the normal spring break trip to the beach, and for many of us, and listen at this one, Senior Skip Day. It is absolutely no fun skipping home. And I thought his last response was profound, and one that I bet each of you would agree with. He said, Most of all, I miss the daily interactions with my friends, classmates, teachers, and school staff for the last half of the semester when we could not attend school. Seniors, I bet you agree and appreciate that response from this young man. An old adage reminds us that sometimes life is filled with changes and challenges that can be brought about by things and happenings that we cannot prevent, like COVID-19 pandemic. Yet life goes on, and the plans you had made start of your senior year may have changed. However, most of your plans are probably the same and still possible, and I am sure you are preparing for them to take place. College, for instance, military service, or beginning a career, your 13 years of schooling that you have completed should have prepared you for those plans. I know you join me in thanking your principal and the total administrative team, your teachers, counselors, and other school staff for their assistance in helping you get to this moment. Most of all, you want to thank your parents, other family members and friends, for their love, care, and assistance in helping you get to this stage in your life. Parents, you've done well. Your graduates will make you proud. On behalf of the Gwinnett County Board of Education and the administration of Gwinnett County Public Schools, we are proud of you and wish for you the best in all your life's endeavors. Godspeed. Hello friends, family, and of course, members of the class of 2020. Hey mom, hey dad, hi Miss Miller. <laughs> now, in case you don't know, I'm Alice, and this is my little brother, Bill. That is me right there. And a couple of days ago, Bill and I were given the seemingly impossible task of summing up this crazy and unpredictable situation in just under eight minutes. This was right after we had learned that three Fridays ago was possibly the last time we'd ever set foot in our classrooms, that we might never see those familiar faces that we'd been seeing for the past 13 years ever again. Yeah, coronavirus is terrible. It is no good. It really isn't. And we've been struggling with how to write this because if you're watching this, it means that nearly a month has passed since Bill and I have recorded this speech. And we have no idea what life is like for you guys right now. We don't know if we're finally free of our homes or if we're still in, trapped indoors with our annoying twin brothers. But if there's something that we know, it's that... We just want to go back to normal. Please, even school lunch. Life has thrown us a curveball that no one has seen coming. You know, they always told us that all these four years of cramming and bubbling circles on scantrons was going to be worth it. Because you know what? We had senior year. They told us that senior year was going to be our best year that we were gonna make all these amazing memories at prom and senior picnic and graduation. But instead, we have digital learning days. Digital learning days. I hate digital learning days. Right? It's crazy that one day you're just sitting in your car in the long, long corridor line for half an hour, just wishing that you'd never have to wake up before 6 a.m. again, that you'd give anything to not have to sit through another lecture. And that same day you learn that, congratulations, your wish has been granted. 
So you spend the next month or so cooped up at home, not knowing when you're gonna see your friends again, if your college or job or any other post-graduation plans will even be there in the fall. I just wanted to go on my senior trip, man. We've spent our entire lives working for this and looking forward to this. And we get it. It's so frustrating and upsetting. I don't think I've heard any words as devastating as virtual graduation. But now, looking back, I can't think of a, a more appropriate send-off into the real world. Life is all about curveballs, about hoping and dreaming and planning, and then discovering that those hopes and dreams and plans don't always come true. And now, as we're on the brink of adulthood, we're now finding that things don't always work out the way we want them to, and that more often than not, it's up to us to keep going and improvising. It's an uncomfortable truth of life, but so far, class of 2020 has taken this all in stride. For the most part, we've managed to stay six feet apart and keep marching on in these uncertain times. We are redirecting our focus and setting our sights on bigger and better things. And okay, all jokes aside, for every moment Alice and I have spent grumbling about 6 a.m. wake up times or long lectures, we've spent a million moments so grateful to be at the school and surrounded by all you people. Thank you to our teachers for putting up with us every day and supporting us throughout this journey. Thank you to our administrators, counselors, and other school staff for making the crazy stressful experience that is high school just a little more bearable. And of course, thank you to the class of 2020 for making early mornings, long car rider lanes, and grueling 90-minute classes completely worth it. Thank you for allowing us to be a part of your stories because in turn, you've made ours so much more exciting and meaningful. We're so excited to see you write the next chapters of your life. And we hope that come July, we'll be able to actually graduate with you in person. Congrats, class of 2020. Thank you for these amazing three and a half years. And we can't, can't wait to see you in the future. At Peachtree Ridge High School, we are dedicated to pursuing the standard of excellence. The 2020 graduating class modeled the standard of excellence each and every day. Our crest is marked with symbols that represent academics, arts, and athletics. During their four years at Peachtree Ridge High School, this year's graduating class excelled both inside and outside of the classroom. Their commitment to success, regardless of the circumstances, sets the example for current and future students, and has resulted in an impact that will be felt throughout our community for generations to come. Graduates, I want you to be proud of your accomplishments and take with you the memories and satisfaction of a job well done. Today's graduation is the culmination of a long journey from kindergarten until today. While the COVID-19 pandemic has certainly changed the way we live, this virtual commencement evidence of that, you deserve to be celebrated and we are here to celebrate you. You have each left your mark on our school, community, and faculty and staff probably more so than you could have ever imagined. To the entire class of 2020, congratulations. Be proud of your achievement. Take with you the memories, knowledge, and satisfaction of an amazing job. We're proud of you and we miss you. I hope you will fondly remember your days as a Peachtree Ridge student. It has been my great honor and privilege to serve as your principal. I'm particularly proud of how well you have loved and showed pride of ownership in our school. You have accepted every challenge presented to you, this no more evident than the last two and a half months, resulting in an outstanding legacy that you leave with us today. Just as we've experienced this year, life is full of unexpected challenges. I know each and every one of you have dreams, and during these challenging times, it may seem that your dreams are impossible to reach. Nelson Mandela once stated, it's always impossible until it is done. During your time at Peachtree Ridge, you have shown dedication, desire, and work ethic, and I just know that you will accomplish all of your dreams. While you will be missed, I'm looking forward to seeing the amazing things you accomplish. On behalf of the Gwinnett County Board of Education, I verify that all qualifications of Gwinnett County Public, School, Public Schools and the state of Georgia have been met. Therefore, I authorize the release of these diplomas to the graduating class of 2020 at Peachtree Ridge High School.
you are watching our virtual commencement in your cap and gown and are now officially recognized as graduates of Peachtree Ridge High School, it is time to move your tassel from the right side of your cap to the left side. Congratulations. Class of 2020, Peachtree Ridge High School graduates, you did it. Parents, grandparents, family members, and friends, congratulations. As a parent myself, I know that it takes a village to raise a child, and you too should be proud of your graduates' accomplishments, as I know you've had a huge impact on their success as well. How I leave you today should not be a surprise, as it's something you heard over and over during your four years at Peachtree Ridge High School. Congratulations again, and go Lions! <laughs>